A matchup of two very successful tag teams. Next up on USA Championship Wrestling, former WCW Tag Team Champions, Mark Jindrak and Sean O'Hare to face off with former Ohio Valley Wrestling Southern Tag Team Champions, Rob Conway and Nick Densmore. And Scott Hudson, you know what I'm going to say about this match? Go. Everything, because I love all of these guys. I love both teams because they're from Ohio Valley Wrestling in Louisville, Kentucky where wrestling is king, where wrestling is God. And these two guys, or these two teams rather, are two of the preeminent teams in OVW. Now why is it called Ohio anything if it's in Kentucky? Because if you were not geographically challenged, you would know that the Ohio River separates the state of Kentucky from the state of Indiana. Hence, it forms the Ohio Valley. And right now, Mr. Wrestling Nick Dinsmore with Mark Jindrak in the ring. Dinsmore's partner, Iron Man Rob Conway, they comprise the Lords of the Ring. Mark Jindrak's partner, huge Sean O'Hare. It's going to be a tremendous tag team competition. Rest lock now by Nick Densmore. Jindrak and O'Hare graduates of the WCW Power Plant Training Academy, the late, great, but, long but minute training camp. Don't hold that against them because they've been oh, training on. in OVW since then. They've actually become great wrestlers. They weren't that bad when they got there, Jim. Come on. Oh, come on. WCW could take a great athlete and turn him into a paraplegic in 10 minutes' time. Look at Conway. Been done. The Iron Man, Conway and Dinsmore, started their careers as a tag team. Then they both branched out into singles competition. They've been back together as a team for about four months, and that's where they feel the most comfortable. Hence, they are called the Lords of the Ring because of their tremendous technical expertise. In this contest, Jindrak and O'Hare will have the height and weight advantage and maybe the strength advantage so Dinsmore and Conway are going to have to do what they can to keep this match grounded try to get their opponents onto the canvas that may be their best hope well Conway and Dinsmore have the experience advantage both of them True. have about five years under their belt They're only two or two and a half for Jindrak and O'Hare but look at the power Jindrak with that waist lock go behind there Conway was trying to separate it couldn't so Conway standing switch takes his man down and to a front chantry on Jindrak and the Iron Man, Rob Conway, showing me something here. Doing just what I said, trying to get Jindrak to the canvas, but Jindrak pulling his man back into the corner. When well, now Jindrak, oh, you got to watch him, but he's a southpaw Ooh. with the left hand. The native of Syracuse, New York, he was a tremendous multi-sport star in college. Now makes the tag, and look at this specimen, Sean O'Hare. Oh. Got to go 295, and he's about 6 feet 6. He is a mountain of a man. All muscle and all mean. Shoot fighter extraordinaire O'Hare if he comes off the top with the Sean Tyler oh. bomb. That might do it, but that was a lariat into the corner and rocked the Iron Man. But Rob Conway fights back. O'Hare into the top turnbuckle. Big chop across the chest from the Iron Man. Opening up on Sean O'Hare. Sets him, shoots him across. Reversal. Conway into the corner. Oh, what a clothesline. Drops Sean O'Hare. Well, Conway so explosive. Now the headlock makes the tag to Nick Dinsmore. Dinsmore and Conway will make frequent tags. Because they are so uh, so comfortable with each other as a team, they always know where they are in the ring, and they're going to try to make frequent tags to wear down the bigger men. Because as you know, or you should know, Scott, a bigger man's not going to have the stamina of a smaller man. Exactly. And I know Densmore and Conway want to try that, but look at O'Hare. Slowing down the oh. pace. Oh, man, the arm ringer dropped the left arm of Densmore right into the canvas. And now O'Hare into the left arm of Mr. Wrestling Nick Densmore, but look at O'Hare, just destroying that arm Well, he had that Densmore. Left, he had that left arm wrapped around the rope, and now he makes the tag to Jindrak, and that's not good news Ooh. for Densmore and Conway. The more times Jindrak and O'Hare tag, the worse it is for the smaller team. Did you see Jindrak cut off the ring after the tag? These men, oh, wait a minute! What a forearm shot off the ropes, and Densmore, out of nowhere, what fire! Back elbow from Dinsmore. Down goes Jindrak. Version of a snap mare lateral press, and Jindrak kicked out at two. Well, Dinsmore is going to keep the pressure on, and so will Conway, because they use their speed and their agility to their advantage. They keep the pressure on and constantly change partners. And this hatchet-headed referee, oh, wait a minute. That's not hatchet that's head. That's not hatchet head. No, that's goofball. That's Anthony Ingram. Well, he's confused. Senior USA Championship Wrestling official. He doesn't look tag. like he's a senior in high school. Double hip toss. Down goes Jindrak. And O'Hare comes in and gets the same treatment in the Lords of the Ring, clearing out the former WCW Tag Team Champions. 
went out Jindrak and O'Hare. They've got to get this thing back under control. They have got to dictate the tempo because if the more experienced team, Conway and Densmore, leads the tempo and the pace of the match, well, Jindrak and O'Hare are going to be left out in the cold. We're at the Mecca, the Fairgrounds Arena in Music City, Nashville, no, no, Tennessee. You know, I must beg to differ there again oh, because, what? after all, besides the fact that this place is such a trash heap, in my opinion, if you want to know where the Mecca of wrestling is, it's in Louisville, Kentucky. That's is where these two teams are both from. Your mom's house? No, not at my mom's house. Look at Jindrak clubbing forearms across the massive upper back of the Iron Man, Rob Conway. Now Jindrak putting the boots to the midsection of Conway. Oh, this is a vicious side of Mark Jindrak that I never saw on Nitro, I gotta tell you that. Well, Jindrak just tried to stomp a mud hole in the Iron Man and he's apparently gonna walk it dry as well as now. Jindrak closing in on Conway. Oh, there's that looping left hand and Conway with a right hand. Wow. Jindrak with a left, my God, it's Ali and Frazier here. And down goes Conway, only a count of one. Boy, this is high and tight right here. Those rights and lefts from Conway and Jindrak into the ropes goes Conway. Big boot into the midsection. Knocked him literally for a loop in center ring. Oh, and Jindrak showing off for his opponent. Don't know that that's such a good idea. Jindrak, and I'll tell you, this kid, he is so big and so massive. He's about 6'6 six, six or 6'7. Six, Got to weigh 265, and he's got plenty of frame to fill out as he matures. He is going to be a giant. And O'Hare over there, he is a he's a monster. But wait a minute, Conway. Conway, nobody told him he's not 300 pounds. He's got a heart as big as the whole state of Tennessee. Oh, but Jindrak cut him off with a knee into the midsection. Now a boot into the ribs drops Conway. Tag made to Sean O'Hare and the monster of the Jindrak and O'Hare team is in there, Sean O'Hare. Well, you can see that martial arts oh. background. He's gonna use a lot of kicks, a lot of open hand thrusts. Boy, talk about a short fuse. It doesn't take much to set off Sean O'Hare. Oh, uppercut into the gut. And now look, Conway trying to crawl to the corner, trying to tag his partner, Dismore oh. O'Hare was in his face taunting him. He, he got tagged for his trouble, but now O'Hare just choking the life out of Rob Conway. Oh, now see, the, the strategy is, has changed here because Jindrak and O'Hare are staying in control of Conway now. They've cut the ring off and they're keeping him in their half, making more frequent tags. Duck the clothesline. Oh, Conway, he went for that cross body, but Jindrak got that left hand, looked like in the rib cage on the way down. Both men are stunned. Both men took the brunt of that one. You've got two men. Both over 250, just meeting head up in center ring. There's the tag. Mr. Wrestling, Nick Dinsmore in the ring. Mark Zindrak still staggered from the earlier onslaught. There's a drop kick from Dinsmore. Something for O'Hare? No. Oh, Tucked wait a minute. It. But now O'Hare. O'Hare saw Ooh. it coming, but Dinsmore saw Jindrak coming. Jindrak nailed his own man. Jindrak with the left hand. Dinsmore ducked it, but O'Hare from outside tripped it. Oh, and dropped the axe handle. Into oh, now. That's the, that's the quickness. That's the way that these things can change in just the twinkling of an eye. Dinsmore was in control of the whole situation. And two seconds later, he was flat on his back. And Conway is not there for the tag. He was tattooed by Mark Jindrak, and now it's O'Hare. Wait a minute. There's Conway in the ring. The referee trying to keep him out. And Jindrak and O'Hare will take advantage, double teaming, putting the boots to Nick Dinsmore. Well, Jindrak and O'Hare, once again, the mark of a great tag team. If the referee's back is turned, use that to your advantage. And that's exactly, Ooh. oh, man, double leg drop right in the, the lower midsection. The, the what? That the, split the wicket. Make no mistake about it. Dinsmore's in a bad way, and O'Hare, oh! Those are supposed to be north of the belt line, and I'm not so sure. Dinsmore... And gotta, gotta be honest hurts. with you, I was seeing it north. Wait a minute, lateral press, couldn't make it stick. I was seeing it shot slightly north of the of the uh, trunk line. Trunk line? Trunk line. Tag made to Jindrak. You've heard the old saying, trunk line and sinker? Yes. Well, he didn't hit his sinker, but he hit him north of the trunk line. Now Jindrak tattooing him well north of the aforementioned trunk line and really putting the boots to Densmore. Referee distracted by the Iron Man, Rob Conway. Snap mare out of the corner. Now going to surfboard what's left of Nick Densmore, who desperately needs to make the tag to Conway. Oh, what a Saturday night at wrestling. Tonight, tonight, tonight.
only in Laverne, Tennessee at the Multipurpose Center. That's right on Murfreesboro Road, Laverne, Tennessee, right behind City Hall. Look for the signs, easy to find. Laverne tonight, you'll see a 12-man bunkhouse battle royal brawl. The Underground Express are coming to Laverne tonight. Mark Magnus takes on Lucky West. Kevin White takes on Ashley Hudson. Who what a grudge match brewing here when Chase Stevens takes on Big Bully Douglas with Ernest T. Mike Rapata is barred from the building for the North American heavyweight title. Chris Harris will defend against NWA Wildside's David Young. And like I told you, the main event, anything goes. 12-man bunkhouse brawl. It's a battle royal tonight in Laverne, Tennessee. Don't miss it. Get caught up on all the latest pro wrestling news. It's the USA Championship Wrestling Hotline, 860-7000. That's right, 860-7000. Call right now. Get all the latest gossip, all the latest news, all the latest local action, 860-7000. Call every day. Update it all the time. USA Championship Wrestling. If you really want to know what's going on in the world of professional wrestling, this is the number you need to know, 615-860-7000. And Conway got caught sleeping on the apron. He's in the ring and being, and he's distracting the official. In comes Sean O'Hare. O'Hare. There, now, was there a legal tag between O'Hare and Jindrak? I didn't see it. Well, but once again, if the referee didn't see it, it doesn't make any difference. Well, it didn't he's happen. He's asking him. The people, of course, trying to get behind Conway and Densmore here, but that tag or that switch is going to stay. And look at now, with O'Hare trying to put the pressure on Densmore here, not only spreading the sternum, but also trying to dislocate both shoulders, and he's big enough to do it. He absolutely is, probably one-handed. This monster, Sean O'Hare. Nick Dinsmore has been in this contest for the last five or six minutes solid, taking a lot of abuse. Dinsmore ducks the oh. elbow, but Jindrak caught him. Back heel kick. O'Hare, oh, wait a minute, look at top. this. Oh. oh, Sean O'Hare, backbreaker over the shoulder. Side press, hooks the leg, but no. Hooking the leg, O'Hare himself brought Dinsmore's foot over that lower rope to cause the break. Well, Conway trying to, to scream at Dinsmore. Dinsmore doesn't realize how close he is to the corner. Now he does. I think he's turned and seen his partner. But O'Hare standing on top of him and pickle Conway for good measure. At this point, I don't think Dinsmore realizes how close he is to Knoxville. He has really been tattooed by Jindrak and O'Hare. There's the tag to Mark Jindrak. And Conway hit the floor over there, and he is still trying to get his wits back about him. And Conway keeping his cool this time, not jumping into the ring. That may help his partner back into the rear chin lock. And that is the sign of a man who's learning his craft. Jindrak using the ropes for extra leverage to his advantage. Certainly outside the rules, but that's a man learning how to stay just within the rules of pro wrestling. Well, look at Jindrak. Oh, he's trying for that... That pressure again by putting his feet up on that second rope, getting the leverage. The referee, of course, is as clueless as he has been all night. And Jindrak using his weight advantage to his advantage, putting his upper body weight across the chin, and now that extra leverage on the ropes. The referee oh, saw it. He'll call for the break. Yeah, sooner or later, a blind squirrel will find a nut, and that's exactly what the referee did. Oh, oh Jindrak with that left hand again, but look at Dinsmore fighting back. He's gone to the corner, oh, but Conway is not there. Because he got tattooed by Jindrak, got caught sleeping. Jindrak putting the boots to Dinsmore. Field throw back into the center of the ring, keeping the ring cut in half. Hooks the leg, lateral press, and Dinsmore out at two, but barely. Boy, it couldn't have been much closer than that. And the folks here really trying to get behind Dinsmore as he's trying unsuccessfully to fight to his corner. But Jindrak and O'Hare keeping the pressure on. Boy, Jindrak's got some big feet. Just, just ask Dinsmore how big they are. Quick tag. They have until the count of five. And now, Sean O'Hare, the legal man, double back elbow. Lateral press. This could do it. Dinsmore's down. Two and no. Oh, it was so close. Well, now, if O'Hare's smart, he'd better not taunt Dinsmore. He'd better get on him. He'd better put some more pressure on him. I agree. Because this, Dinsmore and Conway are both too dangerous to leave go like that. That's exactly right. And Sean O'Hare making a mistake that may cost him later on. Letting his emotions get the better of it. Stay on the opponent. Never letting it back to his feet. 
But Dinsmore, I can see some fire in his eyes. Here comes Mr. Wrestling Nick Dinsmore. Double chop at O'Hare. Just one right hand. Dropped him like a stone. O'Hare now telling Dinsmore to get up. I don't know if I see the wisdom in that. If you've got an opponent down, don't ask him to get up. Kick him. Wait a minute, Dinsmore to his feet. Oh, a right hand. Down goes Dinsmore. O'Hare, so methodical, so vicious. O'Hare's measuring him again, oh. and he blisters him again, Dinsmore. He's staggering. He's weebling. He's wobbling. He can't get his wits about him. Oh. And O'Hare, I think both men got a shot in that time, but Dinsmore certainly got the worst end. He is back down on the canvas. Tag made to Mark Dendrak. Another surfboard this time. And this battle of former tag team champions. Dendrak and O'Hare, of course, from WCW. Conway and Dinsmore, Southern tag team champions from Ohio Valley Wrestling. And Dendrak and O'Hare, of course, obviously now competing in OVW as well. So both of these teams very familiar with each other. That's why the, oh, wait a minute, Dinsmore. With that spinning heel kick, he took Jindrak down, but now Dinsmore trying to get to his corner has rolled to the neutral corner. That was everything. Jindrak tried to go to Conway. Now he sees where he is. Both these guys disoriented by fatigue. Tag to a Sean O'Hare. Dinsmore could not make the tag. Oh, and Conway had had enough. He wasn't Whoa. sleeping that time. Tag, Rob Conway. The Iron Man is in the ring with Sean O'Hare. Oh, and down goes O'Hare. Conway drops O'Hare again with a clothesline. Jindrak, oh, did he catch a right hand to the jaw? Reversal. Conway to the ropes. Slide through. Up top. Herc and Rana. Oh, wait a minute. There's O'Hare swinging a miss. Ducks Boots it. to the gut. DDT. Oh, Rob Conway taking care of both then, but Jindrak. Axe handle to the back of the head. Dinsmore's back in this one. He's got Jindrak tied up in the corner. Conway has O'Hare in the other corner. Finally, back even. Two on two. Oh, now wait a minute. Reversal. Reversal. Conway and Dinsmore together. Dinsmore just rolled to the floor. And now Conway is left alone with Jindrak and O'Hare. Dinsmore's outside the ring. Trips up Sean O'Hare. Conway, oh, he bought a left hand from the southpaw. Mark Jindrak, a series of left. And Jindrak, wait a minute, reversal. Jindrak into the ropes. Conway, oh, pancaked him in the center of the ring. Side press, hooks the leg. He made it. He pinned him. Boy, it was just that quick. Jindrak and O'Hare were on top of things. Wow. And suddenly, Dinsmore and Conway turned things around. What a matchup. Two tag teams, no question about it, on their way to the top of this sport. But tonight, Dinsmore and Conway, what a victory for the Lords of the Ring. Get caught up on all the latest pro 